Hey guys, I'm sure you guys might have seen these primitive building videos. Yes, these videos are amazing, good to watch, but sadly guys, most of these videos are fake. Yes, you heard me right. Most of these videos are fake. This is not done by just one person or two people living in a jungle without any tools. There is a lot more behind these videos. There is a lot of architectural planning that is going on in these videos. Plus, these videos are not sustainable. They are harming the forest environment and they are a mess. After the, these videos are done, these are just left over there. So guys, in this video, I'm going to analyze why these structures can be dangerous, harmful to the environment, plus why these videos are fake. So we will be decoding these videos from an architecture perspective. So without any delays, let's get started with the video. So guys, these videos basically started with one channel named Primitive Technology doing, uh, making a house, a very small basic house with bricks and with mud and without any tools where he shows like he has made all the equipments to cut and how he is making the brick, uh, brick wall and how he is making the mud wall where he is seen making a basic frame structure of the mud wall in, on which he is just putting on mud one after the other which is kind of very true people are doing this there are areas in the world where people are still making houses like these there are still mud houses being made like this so it is not false this video was true and it got a lot a lot of likes and views around i think so 10 million views or something it, this videos have got so what happened after this was a lot of lot of channels started making similar videos similar things similar structures but they went a level up they started making swimming pools they started making underground bunker kind of structure which has every amenities in it which has a bed and things like that but guys i should tell you these structures are not safe these structures are not meant to last these are just show pieces in middle of jungle and a lot of people a lot of channel have uh, made videos have shown so this is the video which one of the channel i think so it's called photo expression has shared this video and in which you can see like from the drone footage this that there is at least 10 people team working on the structure yes 10 people and not only this they have mentioned in their video that me and my friend have worked more than 100 days to make this structure which is totally false so it is not that these videos are not good but they are propagating something which is not required and shouldn't be done that much and on that scale in a jungle in a undeveloped land which will probably start harming the environment very soon so guys now let's talk about why these structures are totally unsafe these are good to watch good to see okay fine someone has done this but these are really unsafe here you can see like the uh, depth of this entire structure is around six meter deep and four to five meters wide so what will happen when it starts raining is the soil across the structure will start losing its strength and there is no tree roots or anything to support the soil also so what will happen the load of the soil just next to it after the trench will start pushing the soil inward and what will happen the entire structure will collapse on itself after a certain time because there is no reinforcement there is no concrete there is no retaining wall so this is the reason why we create retaining walls in a structure because the surrounding part or the surrounding uh, the weight on that soil will push the soil inside uh, and as soon as it's lose, it loses its strength and the uh, strength inside the soil that holds the soil together it will start falling off and it might fill the entire ditch also just by the material on the side walls and not only this what is happening other than this is 
they are using materials like concrete they are using materials like brick they are using chemicals so here in this video you can see the water in this uh pond is blue which it can't be so what they are doing is they are using paints they are using the base material which is bluish in color to make the water blue they are adding liquids they are adding water coloration products to make the water look more blue in the video and that's harmful to the nature and environment so this comes into the environmental impact and um, coming on to the actual environmental impact is just imagine a person who is making a 500 square foot uh, structure in middle of jungle which was never never ever developed and it wasn't meant to be developed 500 uh, square feet of structure and even if he makes around 100 such structures so just imagine the impact like 50000 square feet of land is just wasted by this unusable structure that they are making if they make 100 structures of 100 500 square feet so this is the impact there are not only trees there are micro uh, micro ecosystem in a forest which consists of fungi like mycelium networks you can see rodents like um, rats cockroaches and uh, even earthworms and insects and all these things make a forest livable make makes a forest actually survive it's an ecosystem in itself everything is combined with each other so uh, so even if you are developing on even one square foot of land in a forest that area becomes not a part of forest anymore it is just out of the forest because no micro uh, no micro ecosystem can form over there for a long period of time so that's how you are damaging the ecosystem of the forest that's how you are damaging the ecosystem of the ground of the forest and if we keep encouraging such videos what will happen eventually is like there will be too many content creators inside the jungle digging up the jungle and making such structure and it can become a big nuisance i'm not against these videos i'm just against damaging the forest and lying to people that it's done by just two people it's not at all done by two people there are reports that even engineers and some architectural help has been provided to these people to create such structures they have entire teams now with millions of followers obviously it you will have teams they are not real architects or civil engineers to create such structures these structures are just artificially made just like a set to show you guys and gain your views and nothing else so this was my small analysis of this video i hope you like it i hope um, you will stand against these kind of practices and save the environment save the nature take care of yourself and uh, hope to see you soon with such more interesting facts